guys, the Jace Dog here, and welcome back to another unboxing on the channel. That's right, guys. So today I will be unboxing the WWE Tops Road to WrestleMania. This is the fourth of four of the booster box unboxing, guys. So that means if I open this bad boy right up right now, we only have six boosters left to unbox, and that is it for this so far. As you can see, it's empty. Nothing under the styrofoam, probably not. And nope. Okay, so there we go guys. We are doing the last six of this box. And then we'll be ordering another box of these bad boys right here guys. So that we can unbox some more later on. But like I said, we have six boosters to unbox on the channel right here, right now. Make sure you hit that like button hard guys if you do enjoy all these unboxings and gameplays on the channel. But not too hard guys. Don't break your computers. Make sure you follow me on Instagram, Twitter and Facebook. All their links will be in the description down below guys and make sure if you haven't already you hit that subscribe button so you can join the dog sweats by the way the jstock to everybody you know guys when you're subscribing definitely tick that little bell so you can be notified every single time i upload a new video to the youtube so not even compile the dog squad become part of the notification dog squad that's right guys so like i said this is the fourth of four of the first ever booster box unboxing that's right guys so pretty much i'm gonna order another one of these um wwe 2017 road to wrestlemania tops cards uh, i'm gonna like the box I'm gonna order that when I move down to Newcastle so unfortunately you know this would be the last video of this for a while until I move down there and then I can order one and then I'm gonna also like order like vintage NRL cards and vintage WWE cards that being said guys let's get right into it we're gonna unbox it we're gonna unbox all of these six and see hopefully if we can get some awesome cards we have yet to get any like awesome like relics like event used relics or autographs which I really really want at least one of those so hopefully we can get it in this unboxing guys because really all that we've gotten so far is we've gotten the blue Brock Lesnar card which was you know numbered on the back which is pretty cool and a bunch of done and then a bunch of John Cena tribute cards so let's hope we can get some awesome pulls in this one guys okay guys here we go last six to do on the channel and then like I said after that once we've done these last six, there won't be any more of these bad boys for a while, so get a good look at that booster package, guys, because that's the last time we'll see this until probably at least minimum of a month, maybe, and then hopefully I'll be down there by then, and I'll order some, and I'll get it hopefully really, really quickly so I can unbox some more, because I love unboxing these WWE cards. So we're starting with Kofi Kingston, Natalia. Oh, it's just Kalisto. It's the bronze Kalisto. That's pretty cool. So we want to keep all of these awesome like WrestleMania cards over on this side, and then we're gonna put like the bronze and rares over here. So that's pretty cool. We got Maurice returns to WWE. Damn, you know it's awesome that she's back. We got the League of Nations breaks up. Oh no, he broke up with him. Hoo boo hoo. <laughs> Roman Reigns defeats AJ Styles in Extreme Rules match. Pretty awesome. And then Daniel Bryan and Mick Foley are named the new general managers. Well, Daniel Bryan still is, and Mick Foley's not. So, Kurt Angle. And of course, we got that Undertaker thing. Pretty cool. Like, we're going okay. You know, I've got a bunch of awesome bronze cards. I really, really, really want to get another one of these booster boxes and break it again, guys, so that we can, you know, do another four videos worth. And then, like, maybe after I do another four, we'll do, um,. A live stream where I get like the third one and I unbox the whole thing live so you can all watch that guys okay here we go gold dust put him over there Sheamus and then a free pack so that's pretty cool definitely add me on that guys the J Dog add me on WWE Slam pretty cool so we got a free pack we got Sting announces his retirement at the WWE Hall of Fame induction ooh that was pretty you know he's not really retired just retired from WWE wrestling we got The Godfather joins the WWE Hall of Fame. We got a lot of WWE Hall of Fame cards. Triple H assaults Roman Reigns. That was awesome. Uh, we have Roman Reigns and Dean Ambrose qualified for the Fast Lane main event in 2016. And then Triple H eliminates Roman Reigns in the Royal Rumble. That was pretty cool. And then Triple H went on to win the um, championship that Roman had by throwing Dean out. That was actually an awesome moment. I remember cheering for both, but I was like, come on, Triple H, you can do it. One more time, just one more time, trip. One more time. So we got Zemi Zayn, pretty awesome. Undertaker, 
Ooh, Tatanka. So we got a bronze one. I actually have a t-shirt of him now, so that's actually pretty cool. Second bronze one of this episode. Brock Lesnar returns to declare his entry into the Royal Rumble match. Damn. He's going to be slaughtering people. Yes, he did. He was until he got thrown out. Triple H defeats Dean Ambrose at Roadblock. Oh, I thought it had something behind it. Okay, so the Usos win their first WrestleMania 32 tag team match. Really? Oh no, they win their uh, they win their WrestleMania 32 tag team. I was about to say if it was their first. Jesus. <gasps> Triple H and Stephanie McMahon make a grand entrance. It was pretty grand indeed. Three boosters left, guys. Only three, and then we are done with this series. Not really, but like it's going to be a while until I continue it. So, unfortunately. It sucks that we'll be done with this series for a while, but it's going to come back, guys. And it will come back once I move to Nui. So we got Roman Reigns. Tamina. And then a tribute card. And it is John Cena defeats. And it is John Cena defeats JBL for the WWE Championship. Pretty cool. What number is this? Number 8 of 40. Anyone wants to read that? John Cena fans? Go right ahead. There you go. But that's pretty cool. We got our fourth or fifth ever John Cena card so I think I was I think it was fourth last episode so that's fifth maybe so we got Cesaro makes his return pretty cool we got Charlotte at payback defeats Natalia Seth Rollins returns taking out Roman Reigns oh yes and then Team USA defeats the multinational alliance pretty damn awesome so two boosters left guys can we get a awesome relic card I hope we can get a relic card guys I would love a relic card if I don't get one in this unboxing that's okay because you know I can maybe hopefully get one next time so always take out the Undertaker in the next hopefully you know booster box maybe I don't know we'll see we'll soon find out if we can but Braun Strowman Ric Flair Oh, okay, so we got a bronze the Vord villains defeat the Lucha Dragons in their WWE debut. Pretty cool. So that means we only have one more pack after this to hope that we can get a relic card of some sort. If not, then the best one that we ever pulled was that Brock Lesnar number card and then of course like the tribute cards of John Cena. Okay, Kalisto wins the United States Championship. We have Brock Lesnar conquers Dean Ambrose and the White family. We have Dean Ambrose challenges Brock Lesnar to a no holds barred match pretty cool and then AJ Styles defeats Chris Jericho in their third match pretty awesome damn come on last pack make sure you crush your fingers crush your toes and don't forget to crush your nose guys because we want a relic can we get a relic I hope we can get one hopefully if not then oh well you know we'll pull that Undertaker card out we don't need that okay so Sin Cara Bree Bella, Bree Mode, come on Bree, give me the luck I need, give me the luck. Ah, oh, just a free pack, come on, oh, no, just a free pack though. Like, I swear I've gotten so many free packs, it's good and whatnot to get free packs for the game, but like, give me something awesome, like a relic. Okay, so Brock Lesnar f fires Roman Reigns. We have Dean Ambrose defeats Kevin Owens in a last man standing match, pretty cool. John Cena returns for his, uh, for his United States Championship rematch. Charlotte defeats Sasha Banks and Becky for the WWE Women's Championship and Apollo Crews defeats Tyler Breeze in his WWE debut. Well, we got a couple of alright cards. Let's quickly go through and see what we got in the main WrestleMania ones. So we got Brie Bella, Sin Cara, Ric Flair, Braun Strowman, Tamina, Roman Reigns, Undertaker, Sami Zayn, Sheamus, Goldust, Natalya and Kofi Kingston. So those are pretty cool, you know, I think I'm getting nearly the whole collection of all of them all together. Of the Wrestlemania cards, maybe, I don't know, I'll have to have a look when I get, you know, the chance. And then our bronze, we got the Vord Villains card, pretty cool. We got a John Cena tribute card where he defeated JBL for the WWE Championship. We got another bronze one of Tatanka. We got a bronze one of Kalisto. So we got three bronze and one tribute and a bunch of WrestleMania cards, guys. So guys, that was the fourth episode of the four of this unboxing of this booster box of the Topps WWE Road to WrestleMania 2017 trading cards. If you did enjoy it, hit that like button hard, guys, but not too hard. Don't break your computers. If you want to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, their links will be in the description down below, guys. 
Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you haven't already to join the dog squad. Spread the word of the Jace Dog to everybody you know. Tick that little bell while you're subscribing, guys, so you can be notified every single time I upload a new video to the YouTube. So not only be part of the dog squad, become part of the notification dog squad. That's right, guys. So like I said, I will buy more of these Road to WrestleMania 2017 top cards for WWE very soon. I'm going to probably order another box as soon as I move to Nui, probably very quickly I'll order another like maybe two boxes worth of it and we'll do another four episodes of it and then we'll like, even do another live stream where I unbox the whole thing guys and then I'm like I'm gonna buy like that 14 card or is it like 10 I think it's a 10 pack of cards and you're guaranteed like a relic or a kiss card so I'm definitely gonna get that as well and then vintage WWE cards and vintage traders and all that goodness on the channel guys. So guys, hopefully you did enjoy the start four episodes of this series because we're not done yet with these WWE Tops cards, not by the least. We got a lot more to come guys, so definitely stay tuned for them. Definitely check out the previous videos, all their links will be in the description down below guys. Check out the videos that will be up tomorrow when they're up, so make sure you get that notification bell ticked guys, so you can notify it every time as soon as they come up. But guys, hopefully you did enjoy this. If you did, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. And as always, guys, stay awesome. The J-Stog is out of here. See ya.